Mac OS X Yosemite is available now at the Mac App Store, and there are tons of new features for Apple's latest operating system. I'm Jason Parker for CNET, and today I'm going to look at how to use the latest version of Spotlight. Just like Mavericks, you can open Spotlight by clicking the magnifying glass in the upper right, or by using Command Spacebar on your keyboard. But the first difference you'll notice is the search field has moved front and center in Yosemite. In Mavericks, Spotlight was limited to finding stuff on your hard drive but in Yosemite, you also get relevant web results. To illustrate, I'll do a quick search for pizza. Spotlight will still find all the items with the word pizza on my hard drive and email. But now I can see nearby pizza places from Mapsand if I scroll to the bottom here, Bing search results. From here, I can get the homepage for the pizza place and the address, all without leaving Spotlight. What's especially cool is that with Yosemite's handoff features, I can click the phone number here, and Yosemite will use my iPhone over Bluetooth to place the call directly from my Mac. For even more info about the location in question, I can scroll down on the right side to see tons of images, or scroll a little further to read Yelp reviews and see the star ratings. If I just want directions to the location, Spotlight also uses Apple Maps to show where it is. With a double click, I can open Maps, touch Directions, then send them to my iPhone to make it easy to get there. While the map features aren't new, it's easy to see how Yosemite is connecting the whole search experience together in a way that makes sense. And that's it. The new Spotlight comes with a free upgrade to Yosemite at the Mac App Store. I'm Jason Parker for CNET, and for more Yosemite tips and tricks, check out cnet.com slash howto.